So this is a fuel cell truck uh, running on hydrogen, no emissions at all, only water coming out from the truck. So it's an electric truck, but you generate electricity on board with hydrogen. We have had fuel cells in, in research for quite many years within the Volvo Group, so it's uh, more recent that we have put the fuel cells into vehicles. And then uh, for the market launch, uh, we say that this will be somewhere in the later part of this uh, decade. Couple of hours now. Mm. Uh, it was uh, made some. Uh, That's impressive. Yeah. When you're inside the truck, you can notice that it's very silent, and and you do not have the vibrations that you have in in a diesel truck, and this is of course really beneficial for the driver, uh, but also for the people around the truck on the outside. Yeah, here is the charging inlet for both uh, AC and uh, DC charging that we of course use then to charge the batteries of the truck and the batteries on the truck you can see over here. So uh, in this configuration you have uh, six battery packs that uh, totally gives you 540 kilowatt hours. I mean the biggest difference is that you have other modules uh, that you need to fit into the same chassis and that has been the big challenge from the beginning to utilize the space we have along the chassis to actually fit the new modules instead of fuel tanks and uh, urea tanks and, uh, and muffler you have batteries uh, and instead of the, the diesel engine you have the module on the cab um, and it's So here in Tuve, we produce both diesel, gas and electric trucks on the same production line. It's the same tack time, we use the same people, the same equipment and the same process, the industrial footprint to produce the different kinds of trucks. This area that you see here is the only new area that we have built in the plant. Uh, so we take in the batteries here uh, from Gensen and uh, uh, this has been operated now since uh, almost a year I would say. So right now we are docking the ESS, the batteries on a moving chassis line. So it's three tons of batteries that we are uh, docking on the truck as it is moving. 
So uh, one of these packs weighs about 500 kilograms, so it's three on each side. So Fem, tio, femti vagnar då, va? och en större plockgrund också då. Man har testat klart för det. Så so in 2030, 50% of the volume that we sell for Volvo trucks should then be zero emission vehicles, battery electric or fuel cell electric. And in 2040, everything that we should sell should then be zero emission. And, and, and we, we are looking forward to there will come more charging infrastructure, for example. And that is also then why we are then doing investments into charging infrastructure together with our customers or together with our competitors, Triton and Daimler, to then have then approximately 1,700 charging stations around Europe. And they started really then to, to then take off or growing then in northern part of Europe and in North America. Now it's then moving into the uh, southern part of Europe and we're also then having new markets uh, in, in, in Africa for example. We have also then Australia, we will also now start in Brazil, so that is expanding country by country.